All right, welcome. This is Jay Rivers. I'm going to give a quick tutorial on how to do a screen capture from Ableton Live using your microphone as your mic and getting all your output from live basically to be routed onto your screen capture. All right, so I'm using this program called Voice Meter, M E E T E R at voicemeter.com and what it's going to do in essence is play live all right everything is this is going to be my little mixer and then it's going to route all the audio out to the speakers and then I'm using audacity to record the the sum of the outputs for my audio and then I just have to piece it together it's a it's a workaround it's not really optimal but hey I searched for two days to get this so hopefully it helps somebody else so I have my session pulled up, my mastering session for uh, one of my songs. New day, thank God that I woke up. So Tomorrow I'd like to look back now. on this moment to be glad I spoke up. Feeling like a new man who discovered his master plan here. Take a few hundred grand, spread this word all across the land. The clock keeps counting. So it was, actually I'm going to go back to live. Preferences. So I chose as driver, DirectX or MME. Output device. Once you install Voice Meter, you got to restart your computer, and then it's going to recognize that. So I'm going MME DirectX, and then Voice Meter input. So it's sending all my live output into Voice Meter, and it's going to pick that up once you start playing in live. Then I choose a separate channel for my mic, which I'm using an inbox, an old school inbox, because it, man, it's, it's whatever. And uh, it's going to basically route these both on this Dell computer that I'm using the speakers are uh, they come up as real tech speakers high definition and then uh, I just basically open up audacity the windows wasapi and choose the output speakers and speakers and then it's basically just uh, choosing voice meter so whatever the speakers are playing audacity is recording so this is my little work around that I'm doing where I can make tutorials. Every day is a new day. Thank God that I woke up. Tomorrow I'd like to look back on this moment. To be so my microphone comes out as mono on one side. So, uh, so it'll be, yeah. So I need to click mono right here. And it does have a little built-in EQ on voice meter, which makes it kind of cool. Uh, so yeah, hopefully this helps somebody out trying to make a tutorial on Ableton Live. There's tons of them online, but trying to actually figure it out on how to do it took me like two days. Maybe I'm just a little slow on this screen capture stuff, but if this can help you out, cool. If not, cool. This is Jay Rivers signing out. Peace. You're right, I'm fed up and tired, but to break through to the other side. If I get so close and don't make it, I try to rather me die than be living alive. Be stuck in some meaningless nine to five nine. Sink or swim now. I'm about to go up, not down.